All right, guys, we are on floor 30 of TOA Hardest Floors. Um, welcome. This is my this is the new newest um, TOA Hardest Floors for September. Uh, this is the first floor, starting with floor 30. I, I think a lot of people are going to be, uh, well, some newer players. Uh, this is probably going to be the floor that you're going to be stuck on. Um, probably if you're, if you especially if you still don't have a proper dungeon team ready yet. Like, you don't have anything that you can uh, clear, like, hall of anything, you know, um, you know, be up to B7. Um, I have no idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> if you don't have a team that that can clear most of the easier hall of, like, whatevers, um, then th this floor you're probably going to be struggling a lot on. Um, this time they put Camila on the stage. I'm actually going to pause this. I decided to use this team. This probably isn't the best team for it, but this team consists of a lot of units that I, I, I'm thinking that most newer players have. Um, Shannon Bernard definitely raised one for um, Giants B10. Darien, you know, Belladon. Um, they're just the, the Hall, of, Hall of Light monsters. Um, you know, Hall, Light Secret Dungeon monsters. Veramos, I decided to include you don't really need to have him uh, but he is like a lot of mon a monster that a lot of people have um, you know they fused him to do giants b10 and stuff but uh, the general strategy here is just I'm still gonna just use Shannon Bernard you know Shannon's gonna put slow on them my Bernard's gonna speed me up as fast as possible and what we're gonna do is um, I'm gonna basically just sustain through them I'm going to, if you don't have enough damage to straight out kill Camilla, um, the best way for you to do this is to bring an extra healer or some sort of damage reduction. So um, units like a Darien, um, a Cases, anything like that. Anything that you would use for Giants B10, you can use here. Um, and the easiest way to clear this, if you don't have enough damage, I'm not going to go straight for the boss because obviously my units, these units can, even though they're not really high damage units, they can still kill Camilla because, um, you know, this is only level 30. But... What we're going to do actually do is we're going to try to kill this light vampire. Um, at the same time, you want to make sure you want to land as many debuffs as possible. You, you kind of have to be careful not to crit the Camilla. Um, she's probably going to be hitting you the hardest out of all these units. Um, so we're going we're gonna to try to put attack debuff on her if possible. Okay, it didn't work. Uh, maybe this one will. Maybe it, I don't crit. No, I crit. So it didn't work. Um, if you don't have confidence on landing debuffs on Camilla, you can try to stack them on the light vampires. The arenas probably don't do that much damage. And whenever you have any stuns, just try to CC them as much as possible. And we're just going to keep hitting the light vampire. He has this really annoying passive that stops him from dying, um, unless he is killed by a crit. So um, we're just going to keep whacking him until he one of my units eventually crits and he dies. Alright, so there, my Bella crit and he died. And now we're going to work on this one. Come on, crit. 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 Alright, there we go. And now, if you're confident, you can go and kill this Rena. Um, you know, if you're confident that you won't die anymore, um, you can kill this Rena. Or if you if you don't think you can out-DPS the, the Rena's heals with Camila, what you could do is instead um, try to kill this Camila. Because it's not Camille, um, Rena. Because it's a lot easier landing debuffs on Rena. You can land the armor break, and once you do, you can just pretty much just out damage their heals, um, and then kill the Renas, and eventually kill Camilla. I know a lot of people probably won't have trouble with this floor, uh, but I'm I'm trying to do it. You know, I'm I'm trying to uh, do this floor in a way that will be helpful, or teach this floor in a way that will be helpful for the people that are actually stuck on this floor. Um, you can. It doesn't matter where you, when you found this video. Um, you can always refer back to it, you know, to try to complete this floor. So now, um, both the arenas are dead. The light vamps, they're they're all dead. So like pretty much, I'm no, I'm not in no threat of dying. Um, I have one healer. You could stack two if you're not confident. Um, and I was able to armor break the Camila and just put lots of damage on her. Um, I also have like Bernard to speed buff and attack bar fill. So I can uh, get myself, get my team more turns, and pretty much we just, you just like try to out damage the, the the Camilla and then you win or something like that. I actually accidentally did this floor on auto just now. Um, I came back and did it again. So I'll see you guys in the next video. 
Uh, peace out.